up? How's it going? The screen's the wrong way. What's up, guys? I think you have a shirt on. Good thing I had a shirt on, huh? How about that? What's up? We're live from the Wicked Discount Studio high above Scottsdale, Pennsylvania with Wicked and Miss Wicked here. What's going on, guys? What's going on today? Kigo's car is Ryan. What's up, guys? What's up? We got our Mountain Dews. We got our Mountain Dews. Dave and Bertolotti, did you get your package, man? You did. Because it's still, and it says you didn't. It still says out for delivery. Duke McGird, what's up, man? What's up? Jeff, I hope Miss Airtime gets better. We hope Miss Airtime gets better. All right, Dave and got his package. Sweet. What's up, Paul? Boggs? What is going on? Hit that thumbs up button on your way in, guys. Hit that thumbs up button. This is a perfect time. Well, got mine today, boys. We have mail day tomorrow. All right. This is a good time to tell you guys all about the car. Hey, Pete Miller. Looking for my packages. We'll have to check tracking. Let's see what time. This is a good time to tell you about the 15 channel giveaway. We're going to win $300 worth of prizes. Go check out Lone Star Legends cards. Big case cards and collectibles. Cleveland Card Connection. Lori Mommet. Wicked Discounts. Matt M. Baseball. Jerry's Baseball Cards 2018. Jeff Airtime. Shane Duga. Quato's Corner. Evgeny Crosby. Three River Sports Cards. Stephen Cavino. Brock's Boys. Woot Woot. And Joe iPhone Services. What's up, Miller? How are you doing? Got our cards. Paul, what package are you looking for, man? What package are you looking for? And I'll let you know. If you're looking for... Um, hey, Cooper. If you're looking for Wicked's Wax, it has not shipped. We only ship them on weekends. And last weekend, we did not have time. We only make them as... We made 10, and we made 10 up at a time. So if that's what you're looking for, it is shipping. This weekend. Oh, that would be awesome, Cornette. Yeah, that's cool, dude. Do that. <laughs> Feel better, Barbie Jeff. Do that for sure, guys. Hey, Dennis. So, what's up, guys? B Max is here. He's getting into some trash. Anything else you guys want to talk about today real quick before we get going? We got some mail from RSR. Are we opening Gladiators? I don't know. It depends what's in Miss Wicked's pack. Depends what's in Miss Wicked's pack that she's going to throw out there. I'm just going to throw this out there right now so we can get it going. Uh, we have one, two. We have three Razzes tonight that we're going to try to do. And I also got a, uh, something I want to ask you guys. Uh, our first Raz is going to be for ten random packs of weird packs. $2 a spot, 14 spots. Our first one. Our first is going to be for 10 random weird packs. 14 spots, 14 autographs at $2 with a chance to win 10 packs. That's going to be our first one to get going. And once we get some more people in here, I'm going to talk about something else. Uh, we got our first. We got some packages. Um, these are from Schmo. Jay Schmo. And then we got some stuff from RSR. We got some stuff for Shane Duga, but we're going to keep a little bit of that aside for another week, I think, some of it. Maybe the Rock cards. We're going to open a couple of those Star Wars packs. We got some other stuff from Shane Duga to go over as well. Shane Duga. Duga. So with that being said, hit that thumbs up button so we can get going. That's how we get this party started. You're not talking. What's happening? We're just opening some weird wax tonight. Okay, I'm all by myself tonight. No, I just read the comments. <laughs> so what's going Brandon, on? how's your head feeling? Our first package is from Joe Schmo. Jay Schmo. He uh, sent us uh, Miss Wicked's Care. Not Care Bears. Cabbage Patch. Or my Garbage Pail Kids. Excuse me, Garbage Pail Kids. Oh, yeah. Miss American Gladiators. Yeah, Boggs, did you see that uh, Wicked posted that picture on Instagram and the American Gladiators TV show liked it? How cool was that? That was pretty awesome. Oh, and when do you find out if you made the team or not, Brendan? Because we got to make sure we have all of our fingers and toes crossed for you. Shane Duga. All right, this is from Jay Schmo. He sent some boxing cards in. 
Uh, it's for uh, it's like a cool little thing here. All right. Let's oh, tomorrow you find out. Okay, man, I'll be pulling for you. So this is like a little insert. You can buy, join the Muhammad Ali fan club. Sting like a bee, whatever he says. Float like a butterfly. Sting like a bee. I watched like the really old school ones that used to come on like on way, way back when I was younger. Like a long, 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 long time ago. So I would have to think about them. It seems like they just reused the names throughout the years. Yeah. But I always like the girls because they were awesome. We got Alex Stewart. <laughs> Max, those are not yours. Please. Ike Williams. You'll find out soon. Tommy Burns. See, Advocate, I can't wait to see your mail day video. Bob Foster. Sandy Sadler. George Carp... Let me see. Uh, Carpentier? Joe Gans. Max, you don't have to eat it. Rocky. Right? Hey, guys. So, uh, did anybody see Baseball Betty's video last night? In it, we talked about how she likes to eat stuff. She's got a bad habit. Well, today, we came home from work, and guess what she was doing in the backyard? She was having her own car break last night. We found a pack of cards in the yard that she had chewed open. So, she is truly a baseball dog. Thanks, Boggs. What's up, DFD? MBRC. MBRC. Hey, DFD, how are you? Ah, they're waving the mail around the house. Oh, I'm so excited. So, that I was... I like what we sent. What's up, Bobbies? How are you? So, guys, we're running our 10 random weird packs tonight for $2 a spot. 10 random weird packs, $2 a spot, guys. Let me know. Yeah, Betty's ripping that wax. Yeah, I don't think she got any hits. With Wicked managed to salvage two of the cards, though, so that was cool. But, yeah, she was in trouble. Thankfully, it was like one of those 349 packs that you pick up from the um, Walmart Instead of going down the candy aisle, Wicked likes to go down the baseball card aisle. Where are these from? These are some cool cards that we got in the mail. Hey guys, Bobby posted a video today if you want to go and check it out. He's uh, adding some new content to his channel. He got his um, card break from us and he opened that in one of his videos. So, this is the Looney Tunes. You, if you've watched this before, you know that we do some Looney Tunes stuff. Marvin the Martian's like, you make me so angry. Oh, these are kind of like the ones we have with the athletes. Built in, hang time. Uh, little aliens taking the hop and halftime show. Run and shout. Repeat defender. And then road games. And then it looks like on the back, they've got some quiz questions. These are pretty cool. These are, what are those tiny tune ones we had? Oh, uh, they're, I don't know. They're kind of like that. Those are neat. And then here, oh, look at these guys. Space Jam. How cool is that? Oh, Space Jam. Yeah. Hey, Ashy. Oh, yeah, absolutely, Bobby. We love watching you guys open our mail packs. <laughs> Michael Jordan. Some of the monsters from the movie. They're making a remake of this. I think, right? With, um... Yeah. I can't think of his name, but they're doing a Space Jam too, which is pretty cool. Is it clear for you guys? Because it's really bad. Oh. I have that MJ. I'm an alien. Is it clear? Can you guys see or is it fuzzy? Oh, look at the rooster. Yeah, foghorn, leghorn. DFG says it's good. Duke says it's good. So I don't know what time he goes live. We generally try and wrap it up, though, before he does, like 7.30, I think. He's probably going to go on at 7, but we're going to probably be here till 7.30. Yeah, there are definitely some weird cards. We like these. All right. And then we have 
I don't know what these ones are. Rock. These are Superstar Music Cards. There's Jefferson Airplane, Led Zeppelin, that one, the Doobie Brothers, another Jefferson Airplane. Okay, cool. David can see. Jimmy Page. Maybe it's just my iPad and it's charged. The Who. I love The Who. Who are you? Who, 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 who. They are fantastic. Led Zeppelin. Almond Brothers, another fantastic band. Eric Clapton. Eric Clapton. Madonna. Ooh, as a brunette, even. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. The Doors. Uh, we got The Doors. Crosby, Sills, and Nash. Ooh. We got Debbie Gibson. Oh, yeah. She was in her heyday in my youth. Uh, B.B. King. Almond Brothers again. LL Cool J. And this next card. Guys, I was lucky enough to see this dude in concert. Are you ready for this? My mom did not attend this concert with me. She dropped me and my friend off. Ready? Vanilla Ice Ice Baby. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, yeah. Talk about the cool kids. We are at the Vanilla Ice concert. Yeah, these are really cool, right? These are, I don't know who they're even by. Rock Express. They're pretty cool, though. And then we have... These are from RSR cards, too. Yeah, RSR cards sent us all these guys. So not only does he send out amazing sports cards, but he also sends out these really cool things, too. Anybody know who those guys are? All right, Vogs, we'll try and hold them off a little bit. No, yeah, he is. He's got that show on the Amish channel. And then there's that one. I'm not sure what that is. The Accidental Killer. It's a Valiant comic. What was your first concert, The Advocate? No, I Oh, uh, sweet. I didn't get to see Marky Mark. That would have been even better. There you go, Jeff. You knew who they were. Spider-Man. Ooh, look at that white snake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My friend Tammy at work is like, if I knew there were hairband cards, I would have totally collected those. And I was like, I don't know if there's such a thing. And then, oh, there we go. White snake. All right, guys. All right. So that was that one. We got a couple more from Shane Duga. We might have showed on the fan mail. Uh, the other day, these are pretty cool, too. This is like a Chrome 1992 Marvel's Masterpiece, Captain America, and Red Skull. Pretty cool. Miss Wicked, did you have big... She has big hair now. I have huge hair. <laughs> I have naturally curly hair and have no clue what to do with it. Captain America the bigger, the versus better. I Red Skull. That. Made by Skybox. Pretty cool. They're from the 92 Marvel. I love Captain America. Oh, we He's got something else thing. I forgot to get out. Speaking of that... He is my favorite. Pretty cool, right? though, there. Pretty cool. And then we got these cool... Um, I'm not sure. The, these, I think these are from Shane or Jeff. I'm not sure. We forgot to mark down here they were from. Yeah, we were bad guys. So we definitely got some stuff in the mail, but we're not sure. So if we're not giving the right person credit, we apologize. We got Clint Branger, a Crazy 8 rodeo guy. Saturday, I went in a crazy house cleaning, and I was like, all of these cards have to go up to the room. So, that's my apologies. So, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool there. Pretty neat. I went to college in Montana. This was, like, big stuff out there. The rodeos. These would be cool to, like, try and get TTMs or something. 95 rodeo. Oh, these are made by Wills Racing. Oh, that's cool. High gear. That's what they make the NASCAR cars now, high gear. So, that's pretty cool. I think we lost everybody. <laughs> they're they're all quiet. So that's the mail that we got for Weird Wednesday. Did you open those? No, I did not open those. Ones. We got another pack of stuff. I don't know X Men on the front. X Men. Yeah. These are from RSR too. I think Professor X, Professor Xavier, Shatterstar. These are made by F Ultra Fleer. Fleer. Are you opening package, Wicked? Oh, is this, I think he's opening your package. You went out with the Elvis crazy. 
Hey, Vok. We can only do our mail days on Saturday. Colossals. Because unfortunately, Spiral. our stuff goes to the P.O. Box and they close early. Game Master, we work before we are still in work before they close. And our teeny, teeny, tiny town does not have 24-hour access. They lock it up. All right, sweet, Alec, our DFD. We got Beast. Definitely cool X-Men cards here. X-Factor. Did you guys watch X-Men growing up? Sebastian Shaw. I did not watch any. I don't. I'm not into superheroes that much. Ms. Wicked is crazy about them, though. I enjoy the Marvel Universe quite a bit. My cousin had all the action figures and things like that for these when we grew up. He was really crazy into that Swamp Thing show. I had a bunch of X-Men comic books. They're probably at my mom's house still. I like that kind of stuff. So thank you, guys. I got a red Wicked Will winning. Oh, Dave and Bertie Lottie got a red Wicked Will winning card. Woo we'll do that on Saturday, sir. Saturday. We will we'll spin that. that wheel. Spin to win. How did you get that? How did you get that? <gasps> what are you looking for? I'm looking for some DRC center. Oh. Did you take all the stuff out of the box? Okay, there? thanks, Shane. He sent us a, a PBR bull riding. That's what I like I said, we. um. I was getting a little on Saturday. We had nice weather here. I had the windows open. I was like cleaning and scrubbing everything and everything that was like didn't belong. I was like hustling up the stairs. <gasps> oh no, she didn't, Bobby. That's horrible. What happened? Um, he collected comic books growing up and he had a number one Spider-Man. And when he left home, his sister cleaned out his room and burnt the comic and the baseball cards. Oh. That is horrible. Say, Saturday, I was just like throwing stuff. I was like, okay, this has to go. This has to go. Everything needs to be moved away. We got this box of cards from BRC. Our painting guy, <laughs> BRC here. And we got ourselves a bat in the room. I'm going to play some baseball with him. Marvel Universe. Yeah, I agree with you, Paul. I think that is. People didn't see the value in them, and they didn't keep them. Exactly. So we got this. We can open up a pack or two of for this. So in the background, you see, we're going to try something else. <laughs> so we got Miss Wicked picked up her cards that she won't pick, picked out for the week. What's up, Yankee? Or Mike the Yank? We got some dinosaur attacks packs. <laughs> Dinosaur tax packs here. Yeah, just a little, lol. We got some Bone comic book pack. Some Beginner's Bible packs. These three I just grabbed out of the box. Power Rangers. Cool Power Rangers. Miss Wicked's Disney cards. Yeah, I gotta get a moment somehow, guys. 90210. Woo woo. We're, so, we're uh, searching for that um, Luke Perry card. We ordered those a couple of weeks ago. It's unfortunate what happened. Can't wait to see the Marvel cards. Yeah. We'll grab a pack of them out, too. And we got the American Gladiators. These are like the original American Gladiators, too. So on... From uh, the 90s. So on Wicked Weird Wednesday, I started picking up some stuff that we could do some crazy stuff with. And I picked up this Hobbit card. Autographed. Autographed Stephen Hunter a Hobbit card, guys. It's a personally signed from the Hobbit, the Battle of Five Arms. Uh, for a chance at the will winning, guys, $1 a shot. $1 a shot, you get yourself a nice Stephen Hunter autograph. He played... The Hobbit. The or Hobbit. He was in The Hobbit. I don't he know what he was. in The was. Hobbit. A nice little actor autograph. Yeah, Pretty cool. David Berlotti likes the 90210. One buck a chance, guys. If anybody's interested, one buck a chance. Jeff Airtime, those dinosaur attacks, I had never heard of them. And then... When we were like researching what we were gonna buy, I looked them up and I was like, "Oh, those look pretty cool." Well, today I like looked them up on Wikipedia, and um, Tim Burton was actually gonna make a movie based on these, but then Jurassic Park came out, and so he decided to not do this movie. But there's companion cards to these for Mars Attack, and so that'll be fun. Hit refresh, guys, if you have to. What's up, Book of Festus? Oh man. What's up, guys? 
All right, so... Paul had a warehouse job where they burned a pallet of Kellogg's cards because no one wanted them. Really? Yeah. Hey, Kyle, how are you? I would have definitely took them. I am pumped for the dinosaur tax cards. I think they are really cool. Hey, Newsoms. What's up? Yeah, there's some Star Trek back there. We're going to open a pack or two of them, too. Those are from Shane Duga. Shane Duga. These are from... Ooh. Hey, Robert Posada, what's up? Yeah, I thought it was really cool. Like I said, I just, I've just i been kind of excited to open those cards, and today I was like, I'm going to look them up and see what it was about. And I've seen the movie Mars Attack, so I guess they have like a whole storyline that like follows these cards. So I'm really excited to open them. I well, think get to it. more so than some of the other cards this week. So we'll see what they are. And they have the gum. Oh, wow, oh man, Kyle. we would love that. We'd love to check that out. <laughs> they wouldn't burn unless you separated them. That's crazy. Okay, so these are the dinosaur attacks. Our first card is the sticker card. <laughs> they are known for being a little graphic, too. There we have uh, the dinosaur eating the person. Hmm. Okay. Oh, first thing up, we got a checklist. I know somebody who would be into that. And then here's the synopsis. And then Colby here we go. Lansing. We have Dinosaur Attacks, Animal Wars, Day of the Duckbill, Anchorman's Peril, and Ripped Out of Time. And then on the back, they've got like little short stories. So I thought they were kind of different. C card 50 for the gruesome fate. Okay, that's cool. So like with this one, it says, Helen completes the reversal sequence and presses the red trigger button. All over the world, the prehistoric invaders are ripped out of time, but so suddenly and savagely that they are literally torn to shreds. I see their spectacular destruction on their Prometheus monitors, and I see Helen, my beloved Helen, face stained with tears, knowing full well what she has sacrificed to save the human race. So this must be one of the later cards in the set, but, you know, that's still pretty cool. And that's crazy. Yeah. All right. So that's, uh, that's what the dinosaur attacks looks like, guys. I'm going to open some church cards after that. Yeah. Throw the down of church pack. Oh, the gum's here. intact. Oh, it even comes with gum. Yeah, yeah. I might have to see if I can collect all uh, 55 of these. You guys are quiet tonight. Oh, let's see what we got here. We got Moses. Oh. The other rulers got the king to sign a new law saying no one can pray to anyone but the king. And a maze on the back. I think I got these at vacation Bible school when I was younger. Did what you? year are these? See the wrapper? Yeah, we might have. Or I passed them out when I worked at one. They seem familiar. Daniel was a wise roller. The other rollers were jealous of Daniel. They came up with a plan to get rid of him. <laughs> Which angel is different? Oh, that's cool. See, so advocates are working and listening. And then oh, we a got pop -up. a Moses pop up. Yeah, yeah, story time with Miss Wicked. Moses pop up. Maybe it'll bring us some luck. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Fold them under here. These are cute. They all have games on the back, too. Like, how many words can you make out of the letters in Daniel? These are from 95. Which line is different? That's kind of cool. Different. Yeah, I listen to you guys all day when I'm at work. What's up, Joester? Hey, Joester. You just missed it, man. Look what I pulled. A checklist from Dinosaur Attacks. Yeah. Hi, guys. I'm Moses. I'm here to save the world. Um, all right, let's see. What else do we have? Um, let's do the 90210. Let's see what these uh -oh. are. Uh-oh, 90210. Woo, woo. Do you, yeah, I think they passed. I think they were like a vacation Bible school giveaway. 
They're pretty cool, though. Oh, there's 10 pop-ups in all. They were in that random lot we bought off of eBay that had all the really crazy weird stuff in it. 90210 time. We're looking for the Luke Perry. Let's see. Wait, you got a Dodger autograph, DMD? Who put that in there? All right, let's see. Oh, we have Steve. First up, I think that's the puzzle back. Okay, we have Brandon. First up. Oh, there we go, Luke Perry. Oh, there's the money card. <laughs> there's Steve again. Oh, it's Donna on the surfboard. All the boys are carrying her. That's a great publicity shot. I don't know. Who got the redemption last night? Paul said that he tried to get it at 4 a.m. and it was already gone. Yeah. yeah, seeing the king of Sharknado. Ooh, there was the nerdy Gabrielle. She was always super smart. And then, this is just like an advertisement. 88 yeah. cards with 11 stickers. And it gives you their names on the back. Like, who needs the names? I've got them all memorized. Steven Hunter autograph. One dollar a chance, guys. One dollar. We have Brenda and Dylan. Ooh. And then we have Brenda and Brandon. He got it, Alex? I thought he was just kidding with us last night. Oh, Bobby checked it at 5 a.m. and it was redeemed. So those are kind of cool. I probably actually bought these when they came out based on the year. <laughs> Shane Dugan was up till 4 a.m. crying last night. Yeah, we thought he was kidding, Paul, but maybe he did get it. Yeah, maybe he did get it. All right, what are you doing next? I was going to just keep do, on looking We're going to do a Star the Trek. All right, do the Star Trek. Either from Shane Duga. He sent us a box of these. 94. All right. Poor Shane. I felt bad. Well, speaking of last night, guys. Speaking of last night, I'm going to run a deal. It's down in the, down in the thing. Description. We're going to try to do this without doing it through eBay if anybody's interested. 30 spots we have. You're going to watch the reboot of 9210? Um, I don't know. We don't have cable. We only have like Netflix and Hulu. So if it comes to one of those channels, I'll probably get around to it. But I, for as much dumb trivia as I know about 90s TVs and movies, I don't watch a lot of TV. I'm pretty bad about it. I watch a lot of YouTube, mostly like baseball card videos and stuff. And I watch a lot of Disney videos, shocker. These are Master Series by Skybox. So Saturday night, I'm going to try something if you guys want to off of eBay. Uh, we're going to do 30 random teams, four box break, three boxes of Don Ross, one box of opening day, $24. $24. Aw, that was nice of you, Joster. Oh, Bobby, you were on there at 1 a.m. and the site was still down. They said that Panini's really slow, too. So we have that option for Saturday night, or we could do Pack Wars again Saturday night. So I'm giving you guys the option, like I said, three boxes of Dawn Rust, one box of opening day. So four boxes for $24 shipped. Four boxes, $24 shipped. That's... Sorry, I don't know much about Star Wars, though. <laughs> or Star Trek. Um. I watched the Next Generation Star Trek, but I don't remember a whole lot. We love you too, Shane. I just remember Wesley. Because he was so hot. Will Wheaton. All right. And we got another Dylan card. Kelly. She was totally my favorite. Because she was blonde. There was Brenda. Jester knows everything about Star Trek. There's Brenda again. Aw, there's another Dylan. He was definitely the heartthrob on the series. Brandon. Brandon. He had that job at the Peach Pit. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly and Brenda. This is totally how I wanted to dress all the time. These girls were the coolest. And then we have another Dylan card. These ladies set the example for the best way to dress. Um, let's see, what should we do now? Disney. All right, I'm going to do a Disney pack, guys. I'm trying to get my binder full. Because uh, I got a box of these for my birthday. And I'm trying to get the whole set. And then I want to take doubles with me to Disney. And unfortunately, I'm at that point where I'm starting to run into doubles. There's a little goofy. So if anybody likes uh, Disney, 
You don't have to like it as much as I do. You just have to sort of like it. I can uh, definitely send you some of these cards that I have doubles of. Just let me know. Just let us know. Yeah, yeah. Because Shane was the one who introduced me to these cards, and they're like my personal Pokemon. I got to catch them all. When are we breaking opening day? Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. We picked it up today. We got a big old case of it. There's Goofster, he's so cute. And then we got Goofy. Okay, box break, send me your address. I'll send you some. Like I said, I've got, um, I'm trying to fill my binder up, but I um, need to, um, I got extras and I would love to see him go to somebody who would like them. If we get 30 people, we'll do it. That's, so just wait, Bobby. Box break I'll put you down for one though. One spot for Bobby. Like I said, if we get 30 people, we'll do it. I just want to write down. All right, Power Rangers, Joester. Daughter. Four Brogs break, three Don Ross, one opening day Saturday. We're trying to do. If it doesn't sell, we'll do Pack Wars, I get. We'll try to do pack wars and mail. Oh yeah, you know we got a pack of Power Rangers. Oh, these are like. Are they sticking? They're like glued together. Oh jeez. Hey, Bob's, you did not miss the gladiators. Yeah, don't send payment yet, Bobby. I'll let you know if we can fill it. You don't have the email yet. Oh, it's um. Here's our email. Not that one. The wicked discounts. 34 at gmail.com. Robert P. will take a spot. All right. Just send me an email with your address. Robert P. will take a spot for the four. All right. Let me know. Uh, if we can fill it up, we'll see how it goes. How about some wicked, weird Star Wars? Ooh. I don't think we have any Star Wars. We might have to pick some up. The wicked, weird Star Wars. Twice? We got the group. Awesome Wonder Bread Star Wars. Those are amazing. Vogs, I'm not sure, man. Huh. Yeah, I'll let you guys know if we can fill this break or not. I'm just trying to do it off of eBay. We might do Pack Wars instead. We're not sure yet. Yeah, Pack Wars was fun, guys. Alex wants a spot. All right, DFD with a spot. Oh, no, look at them. They took down all the bad guys. These are really damaged from the... Sticking. Aww. Are there any pink ladies in there? Not really. How much for the break? 24 bucks. We're doing four boxes. Three Don Ross, one opening day. If we can fill it for Saturday night. Miss Wicked says, yeah, more sorting. Yeah. It's a hypothetical break right now. We're trying to, to gauge We're just trying to see if we can get it done. Let's see. Let's do a Marvel pack. Oh, these are Skybox. That's who... Is that who? No. Some Disney cards are skybox. Yeah, some are skybox. Right now. Aww. J. Ray's daughter is Leia. Oh, cool. Here we have the Fear Master. Ex Executioner Song. Namorita. Oh, you're breaking down two sacks of Wonder Bread. Yeah, we got some sweet, sweet vintage uh, Star Wars cards that Shane Duga sent us. They're from Wonder Bread, right, Shane? There's Mr. Sinister. Oh, that she wouldn't let you go with Luke and Leia. Why not? That would have been perfect. Spirits of Venom. Oh, one of my favorites. Deadpool. Elijah. <laughs> Guardian. That's funny, Advocate. And Doctor Strange versus Dormammu, I guess. I'm not real sure. All right, four spots filled right now, guys. Four spots out of 30. I'm going to send some emails tonight and see if we can do it. Let's see. Should we do the Gladiators? Yeah, let's do Gladiators. Let's do a pack of Gladiators. Joe, sir, I know you've been looking forward to these. Oh, I wanted to check that out, Box Break Nation. I was looking at them today for the relics, guys. I wanted to see what those mascot relics were. 
Your wife's parents were not happy. I was, okay, I tried. <laughs> oh, here we have ice. Ooh. And then we've got the well-deserved ovation. Diamond. The topsy-turvy. Assault with a deadly weapon. I remember the show being like so impressive when it was on because there was absolutely nothing like it. And now there's like five variations of this. Oh, DFG sent you some X-Men cards too. Roadblock. This was an awesome challenge where they ran through that maze. Yeah, I liked all of the ladies. I thought they were super impressive. Oh, here she is. Ice hangs tough. Man, look at her pipes. Look at that. I know, they were insane. Look at the muscles. They were so, and like I said, they oh, were, there's Nitro. There was nothing else like it on TV other than like the glorious ladies of wrestling, but I think that was before this time. Nitro glistening and Gemini. Those are cool. Yeah, those are sweet family <laughs> portraits, autos. I'm getting some, Shane. You have to tell me who your favorite character is because I'm totally sending you an auto from that. I even talked to Wicked. I've got it like all figured out how I'm going to get the characters to sign them because they're so little. I want to make sure they have something that they can press down on. Yeah, they were insane. Yeah, Shane, so make sure you tell me who your favorite is so I can hook you up because you got me started on that whole series. I want to say thank you and get you an auto. All right, we got some bone cards. <laughs> bone. These are always weird, but they're in the pack, so we got to open them. Does anybody even know what this the bone is? I thought it was a comic strip, but I don't know. I can't even talk They're about just them. bizarre. I can't even talk about them. <laughs> They're from 94? Tough. Does anybody remember these? 94? I thought this little guy was familiar, but I must be thinking of something else. Him. Go, go, Joester and the Wicked Family Rangers. All right, let's see what else we got. Uh, let's do another pack of the Dinosaur Attack. Yeah, I haven't either, Cornette. I'm going to have to, like, look them up. Oh. oh, the gum is busted in this one. What a shame. The only bad thing about the gum that's been sitting on this stuff for the last uh, 30 years is it makes them all sticky. We have an Ankylosaurus. It stains them. We have Star Wars. Do you want me to get you a Star Wars auto? I can. I'm not meeting Kylo Ren again because he was weird. Oh, yeah, I do have to. You still need a Mrs. Boggs. Um, here he we have. He said we have Star Wars. He's saying we have them. You have hot Star Wars, just saying. Oh. Where? We have the Wonder Bread. Did he send us some? The Wonder Bread ones you sent me? The Ultimate Sacrifice. That was Star Trek, right? That was Star Trek, yes. Picnic of Peril. These are You Can't Let Them Win. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, I, I don't like, know where they how are. How did we lose those? I mean, I know this room is bad. Well, I know how we lost them, but I'm like, I don't remember them at all. <laughs> I'm like super embarrassed, but we should turn the camera and you guys should just see. Here, them. I'll just show them. Yeah. Miss Wicked probably does not want you me to see this, but. Look, this so is we're going to start here. Let me move out of the. Cards. Cards. Cards, packs of cards, wax boxes. This is how, why we don't know. <laughs> There's more cards in the corner back there. Cards. This is what, for tonight's episode, I just reach in there and grab stuff. This is all weird <laughs> stuff in that box. There's all weird stuff in this box. There's all weird packs in that box. Oh, I forgot about that box. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, you got to open your Funko. Yeah. Oh, sweet. We got weird. This is this is the mess. Yeah. So guys, we apologize. This is where all your cards. <laughs> this is where all your cards go whenever you are. Um, whenever we hold your cards. Whenever we hold your cards. If you're a high roller, you got a cool box. We're trying to add some high rollers to the boxes. <laughs> Pepino. 
Yeah, we have a ton of stuff, and it's we need to organize it. We are going to buy some stuff this week, and it's on back order, so. Miss Airtime, are you okay? That's not even the attic, Joster. The attic is a complete different nightmare. No one is allowed up there. I'll just tell you guys a story. Miss Wicked started coming to my house. I had a bedroom she wasn't even allowed in for about a half a year. About six months. There was a bedroom she wasn't even allowed in. Still waiting. All right. Hope, you get, hope you're okay. All right, guys. And then the last dinosaur attack is the nuptial nightmare. Travco. Yeah, that Drabeck's available. And look at the back. It's got a wedding reception <laughs> at half after 2 o'clock at the <laughs> Daffodil Club. I keep making more names. I just haven't had a chance, so I'll add more names to it. All right, guys, we're trying to fill a break for sun Saturday night. Uh, 30 spots, three boxes of Don Ross, one box of opening day. $24 shipped. You're not a low roller, Cornette. All of ours are uh, high rollers. We appreciate all your guys's. We're just working on boxes. These yeah. came from um, Coach K. Coach K. I just these don't want to make somebody a box and then have them fall off of the face of the earth. So after you buy a couple times, then you get like a, or even if we trade, then you get a nice one. So that's all. Although I could just peel the letters off. This is from Batman Returns. These are from Big K, Coach K. Here we're going to start out with the Michael Keaton. Hmm. Batman. Alfred. Do you collect any Disney pens? I don't trade Disney pens, but I collect them. And I shouldn't even say that I collect Disney stuff so much as I hoard Disney stuff. I have an obscene collection of Disney stuff, and I don't foresee myself stopping. So <laughs> I'm like, I could sell this. No, no, I like it all too much. We even have a Disney notebook yeah. here. Yeah, I do. I like everything Disney. The mouse makes me happy. Although, I'm not going to lie. You guys make me really happy, too. When I'm at work, I'm like, oh, this is so boring. I sit in my little cubicle. I don't talk to anybody. I just do my stuff. And then we come home, and it just, like, is invigorating to hang out with you guys. I truly, truly think that you're all, like, close friends, and it's just fun. I appreciate that you guys want to sit here and hang out with us, and it means the world to me. I can't even tell you how great I think you all are. There is a lady. I can't remember this part of the movie. It's been it's a long time. It's River Sports Cards. Here's the penguin. I'm opening some mail. <gasps> Del, has you have a blizzard right now? That's what Corn Cor uh, RSR says, too. Oh. And then there's Catwoman. I like Nightmare Before Christmas, too. I like Lock, Stock, and Barrel. I think they are creepy, but they're cute. Yeah, we are a little, a little wicked. I am a chaotic collector. If it's got Mickey Mouse on it or Donald or any of those guys, I need it in my collection. So one day I'll do a living room video. Because for as many baseball cards are in here, that's how much stuff I have. How many treasures I have in the living room. Thanks, Pete Miller. We appreciate that. Thanks, Pete Miller. All right, guys. Stephen Hunter autograph. One dollar chance from The Hobbit, guys. One dollar on a chance. Pretty cool card. Pretty cool card there. These are cool. Skybox because great cards are hard to find. What's up, Ghostface? How you doing, man? How you feeling? I mean, is everything better? Oh, thank you, Jay Schmo. Schmo, we're trying to do a break for Saturday night off eBay. Three Don Ross, one opening day, 24 bucks. Random teams. Ghostface is still in the hospital. Really? Man. <laughs> Shane, uh, we like hearing that you guys are happy with your packaging. We see a lot of videos where people are not thrilled with the way they get their stuff. And uh, Wicked prides himself on packaging stuff. And it took a long time before he would let me help him. So he really takes it as a, you know. Some uh, of the other thing we have for tomorrow night, we have one spot left, 25 bucks for um, 93 Bowman. 93 Bowman. Jeter chasing the Jeter rookie. One spot left. 25 bucks, guys. Oh, yeah, Bobby. It's a really cool community. This whole card collecting. 
I don't know how everybody turned out to be such a nice corner of the internet, but they certainly are, you know? Good. We're glad you're not so bored. We like to keep it fun. That's what we try and bring to the table. <laughs> and this is X-Force versus the Brotherhood of Evil Mutant. These are from BRC, right? Yeah. Oh, the Asgardians. I love me some Thor as well. Lilith. Magneto. Oh, Thor versus the Blood Axe. Oh, then we got Thing. Morbius. Aw, I'm sorry to hear that, Ghostface. Dark Angel. Oh, Red Skull. Bad guy from Captain America. And then Cage. No, I've never seen the Napoleon Dynamite cards. No. I'm letting Miss Wicked talk because she's more into this stuff. <laughs> I mean, I'd kill the baseball and hockey and football. No. Nah. So. It's crazy what they'll put on a uh, trading card. We're still trying to find uh, Rick and Morty ones local. I've seen them online, but I'd like to pick them up in the shop. So Yeah, it goes, face man. We hope you get better soon. Musical Mayhem. Oh, check out Minnie being all sassy. Chiquita Minnie. Oh, you have Rick and Morty. Okay. Uh, Sports Kids, who watch our who watches our channel a lot, he wants uh, to see them. And we told him that it, when we came across them, we'd have to get them. Favorite stories. Oh, that's cool, Jay Schmell. You know what? We always say that the best thing you guys can do is just hang out with us and spend your time because that's the most valuable thing you have. Yeah, exactly. We just wanted to be here and hang out with you guys. Yeah. I'm just trying to see if we can get it sold and do, do some fun stuff Saturday night. If not, we will be doing some uh, pack wars or something cool that we can do. There's Miss Minnie in the original outfit. There's Mickey in a spooky shadow. <laughs> I like the tears, man. Many. <laughs> oh, there's an Olympic champion. Yeah, it is too cold in the garage. It's not oh, worth it. Yeah. I don't uh, know if you were here, but we showed your boxing cards when we first started. Thank you. They're pretty sweet. Oh, they were super, super sweet. Mickey and some cards. Oh, Daisy and Donald. Uh, me too, Del Hess. You know what? I've never seen the cartoon, DFD. Colby watches it. We did that. Three Rivers, we did that in one of these. Uh, we, oh, yeah, we totally did. We've done that already. We lost people like you wouldn't believe. We did the Looney Tunes. Yeah. <laughs> people were falling like flies. Although, I'd like to attribute it to the fact that Jabs went live at the same time. I cannot, get, I cannot, get, to my <laughs> I cannot get to my post office till Saturday, guys. Yeah, well... Um, We'll Thank you, Saturday. though. We can't get our mail till Saturdays. We work too late. That's the one my brother almost peed myself. <laughs> well, that's good to hear, Brendan, because we didn't think people liked it. It was like a Looney Tune. Every pack was a story. <laughs> <laughs> we, we thought it was fun. Oh, that's cool, Cleveland. We saw that he was going on, too. It's cool, man. It's cool. Yeah, there's only so many hours in the day, so. There's always, yeah. I mean, I think uh, the Car Dreamers live with his. There's just not enough hours for everybody. Next Wednesday, we will be taking off, though. Me, me. Demeter Dawn. Me, me. I dressed as Donald Duck once. Yeah, and I was Daisy. What, what? The Behemoth Fries. And then this year for Halloween, he was Sid, Sid. from Toy Story. I was Darla. I won Halloween. <laughs> Wait a minute. How do you know I was dressed as Donald Duck? Were you spying on me? Were you creeping on my... Who said that? Oh, Jay Schro. <laughs> it's just a story until you post pictures. Hold on. I'm getting the picture right now. I'll be dressed like a leprechaun on Sunday. Lights, camera, carnage. I can see why Tim Burton wanted to uh, make a movie. And they're pretty detailed on the back. Like, they've got the whole little stories and stuff. I'm going to definitely have to collect all 55. <laughs> and other news, a gigantic iguanodon attacked the Steinhauer power plant and was literally roasted alive by high-tension wires. Officials expect the plant to be working at full capacity by tomorrow morning, barring any additional dinosaur trouble. You got In a, a moment, the weather. Pirates? That's cool. 
That's cool. I don't have any Pyrocini mates. And it was the one you gave him, too. Yeah. You guys, I don't even know how to use Facebook to get the pictures. <laughs> Let me go to Instagram. It's on my Instagram. We'll show you guys. Donald Duck? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's on my Instagram. And then let's open another pack of Batman. Some of these movie cards and TV show cards make me want to go watch them all over again. Now, this was a pack of 66 stickers. Yeah, no Weird Wednesday. We're going to be in Disney World. So we'll probably uh, live stream at Instagram's some point. Instagram's still down. Instagram and Facebook were hacked today, guys, if you guys don't know. Insta Instagram and Facebook were hacked today. Look at that penguin. He was so scary, Danny DeVito. He was horrifying. Oh, CCC got your package. Oh, look at him. He owned that role, though. He was creepy. And then there were those guys. I like the one with Arnold Schwarzenegger as the Iceman. Because he had the um, Snow Miser song in there. And that's like my favorite Christmas movie. I have them on my phone, guys. Phone, but we're uh, videotaping from there. So I can't really show them to I'm you. I'm getting them. Okay. Let's see. What else do I got for packs laying around? Yeah, Instagram and Facebook got hacked. That's why you can't send any photos on Instagram chat or uh, Facebook chat. And Instagram, you can't even log in some of it. Yeah, Jay Schmo, you were right. He had that down to a science. Here's another ice card. Yeah, the world is close to an ending if the FB and IG are down. Thank God he was wearing pants. He would have had like the teeniest, tiniest little legs. Another Gemini. Oh, the hand bike. I remember watching that and being like absolutely amazed that they could even crank that across the stage. Three Rivers, what time are you having an auction tonight or is it tomorrow? Photo finish. Let everybody know. Ice Speaks. Arnold had too many bad cold. Oh, but he was so good when they were all sitting in the freezer and they were all freezing and he was singing the cold miser. I loved it. All right, yeah, take care, Ghostface. Work on healing and getting better. Zap attack. Remember how they would lock their legs around their competitor and just hang there? That was insane. Nitro was triumphant. Cleveland, did you like your package, man? He said he hasn't opened it yet. All right. The joust. Hey, RSR, how are you? We opened your cards already. We did our mail uh, early, and these are just some cards that we picked up this week. The Eliminator Treadmill. Yeah, it must have been. That thing was sick, man. That thing was sick. <laughs> oh, American Gladiator action figures would be sweet. Oh, those would be cool. Those would be cool. Hey, guys, I know I keep saying it. We're trying to fill this for Saturday. Uh, it's a three-box break. Oh, three, three Don Ross, one opening day. $24 shipped. If we fill it, then I'll start taking payments. Do not pay until then. That's all right, man. $24 opening day. One box opening day, three Don Ross. $24 shipped. We'll do it Saturday night after mail or before mail. Okay, you guys ready? RSR is in for one spot. All right. Okay, this is Wicked as Sid the Garbage Man from Toy Story 3 or 2. And then I was Darla as Nemo. You guys ready? And then that's our BFF there in the middle. All right, RSR, do not pay yet, please, until we find out for sure. What? <laughs> and that was my little fish in the bag. He was sleeping. <laughs> Darla and Sid the Garbage Man. And then I'll look for the other one. Yeah, that was fun, guys. We had a good time with that one. Weird. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Thank you, Joester. We had a good time with that. It was like a million degrees, too. We were sweating profusely that day. I got a Funko Miss Wick is going to open, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Miss Airtime. Thanks, Miss Airtime. We got this going. I picked up some weird stuff for a weird Wednesday. If anybody wants to try to win a Stephen Hunter autograph, $1 a chance. 14 chances. Saturday, I came across like 15 pairs of scissors. Here's a box cutter. Here we go. I heard you got some crazy snow you were telling me earlier, man. Aw, uh, thanks, Tripco. Caitlin is on 
Thanks, Papino. Better watch him this airtime. Oh! Three Rivers Sports Cards is having an auction tomorrow night at 5 p.m. Pacific time. We are going to be live tomorrow night for Throwback Thursday around 7.30 here. So this is what we got. It's in some bubble. There it is. Funko always wraps her stuff super nice. She found this while we were cleaning this room. Yeah, I was like, hey, you never opened that one. <gasps> Look at him. He's so cute. He's the orange and teal. There he is. That's our Funko for this week. We have about seven colors of him so far. Oh, I bet you are RSR. That no bad, huh? always goes over. That bad, huh? Man, Miss Wiggy, you look like a mess here. I know, I crushed those packs. We got another pack of Star Trek here. Welcome back, Dennis. Oh, uh, thanks, Bobby. Yeah, we're out of dinosaur attacks. We did all them. I'll open another one for you. Did you open the Harry and the Hendersons? No. I like this dinosaur attack. I'll do another one. Woo woo, Brock's Boys is in the house. Woo woo. These are Star Trek cards, guys, from Shane Duga. They're really sticky. What's up, Incredible CJ? Oh, these both have gum. Oh, you're cool, CJ. We're going to open up some Star Trek cards, and then we got these beauties Dinosaur and Harry and the Henderson. Oh, it's tomorrow night at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Yes. Okay, cool. All right, so here's the Harry and the Henderson pack. This is new. I love this movie. I thought their station wagon was awesome. It was cool enough that they could hide Bigfoot in it. Here we go. A visit from whom? Oh, and there's Harry. Oh, John Lithgow. I can't shoot him. George strikes back. And then there's Harry and the daughter. Huh. Tanks a lot. And then there was Harry hiding among friends. Did you get anything cool, Pepino Man? Oh, you're getting home. Your LCS puts all of ours to shame. That one is crazy. I watched your uh, video of it. Then there's Harry trying to get into the house. It is the same design, I think. The Hunter Lafleur. And then Harry gets even, catches the Hunter. And then on the back, they just give you like little rundowns. Incredibly strong, Harry smashes Lafleur's weapon and lifts the terrified man into the air like a rag doll. Is Lafleur headed for the happy hunting ground? Tune in next time to see. <laughs> All right, then here's another dinosaur pad attacks. Oh, that's where you pulled the Nolan Ryan 101. My class president uh, from high school is actually married to Nolan Ryan's son. So I thought that was kind of cool. We're going to save them for next week, but if you want us to open them, we can open them. Yeah, absolutely we can. Yeah, that movie was fantastic. Okay. Here we have, I have to say, we haven't gotten a double on the stickers. Uh, terror, I don't even know how to say that dinosaur word. The problem is I don't know where stuff is. Blue water, savage death. Um, you said you can save until next week. That's right, there's one. We'll do one this week and one next week. How about that? Italy under siege. They're there rebuilding our world. Yeah, it's got a silent T or P. I just don't know how to say the rest of the word. Pteranodon, I guess. Pteranodon. Rebuilding our world. Madness in the streets. And then this one is Supreme Evil. I don't know if anybody uh, caught my uh, history lesson on these <laughs> earlier, but um, Tim Burton was slated to do a movie based on these cards, but then Jurassic Park came out, and he decided to uh, do... A movie on their companion cards called Mars Attacks, which I'm sure everybody has heard of that movie. If they're of a certain age, maybe not everyone's heard of it. So there's those ones. And then these 
are the super sweet playing cards that Cleveland sent us. Let's open these guys. I almost feel bad opening them up. They're from 1992, still in the plastic. Baseball playing cards. Oh, there you go. That's us is Donald, Olaf, Minnie, and Daisy. There you go. <laughs> so you want to open these? Yeah. All right. Crack some uh, baseball. I've got gum all over. You got a mess everywhere. I know. It's right. my turn, guys. I made the mess tonight. What's up, Cross? Yeah, you liking that, huh? Liking that. All right, guys. So oh, here I am to uh, sell my stuff like I always do to help the channel. We got three Don Ross and one opening day break. We're trying to fill for Saturday night. $24 shipped. Yeah, it's off eBay, so do not make a payment until I fill it. $24 shipped. Next thing we're doing, a Stephen Hunter autograph. $1 a chance from The Hobbit. Always hustling to try to make help the channel, guys. Like you see, I showed you guys all that stuff. Right, we go through a lot of, a lot of dollars to make this happen. <laughs> Chat is Crosby will take a spot. All right, Crosby with one spot in the break. Thank you. Thank you, sir. F 25 more to go. And then we can make it happen. Shane, look what I found a whole stack of them. They're not in my binder. <laughs> <laughs> they were on top of Wiggins' desk. All right, these are playing cards from. They were hiding. These are MLB playing cards from 1992. They've been in the package since then, and we just busted them open. We got Dennis Eckersley. Dennis Eckersley, the wild card. Pretty cool, Dennis Eckersley. We got the Jokers, the Muse, the Moose, and Mark Langston. Mark Langston as the Joker. We got Griffey Jr. You didn't get one, RSR? We'll send you one. What did you get? Autograph. Oh, yeah, man, we forgot to put in your box. I'm sorry. We'll get you one. Three reverse T's and stickers. I'm having a hard time selling my T-shirts. Your stickers are sweet, though, Three Rivers. Yeah. I Pudge. watched your um, giving back video, guys. He's got a contest going on right now. Um, if you haven't checked it out, I recommend it. What's up, Card Dreamer? Sorry we missed your thing tonight. Brady Anderson, Travis Fryman, Jeff Montgomery, Jack McDowell, Kevin Brown, Roger Clemens, Jose, Kyle Ripken, Kirby Pocket. That's cool, Pepino Man. That's cool. Oh, that is cool. Kirby oh, look Pocket. Look at that grin on that. That's sweet. Tony Gwynn, Bob Terrisbury, Ron Gant. Huh, I love these uniforms. Doug Jones, Biggio. Look at Biggio cool in it. Bip Roberts. Norm Charlton, John Smoltz, Lee Smith, Tommy Glavin, Benito Santiago, Terry Pendleton, Bobby Barry Bonds. Barry Bonds is the king, baby. Wade Boggs, Mark McGuire, Sandy Alomar. You seen these great? That'd be cool. Oh, that would be cool. Hall, Hall of Famer Edgar Martinez. Carlos Bayarga, Paul Molitor, Ruben Sierra, Chapin Oblock, Robin Ventura. These are sweet. Charles Nagy, Juan Guzman, Joe Carter. Oh, look at Robbie. Chilling it. I bet you Wahoo will make an appearance. In Fred McGriff, Ozzy Smith, Sandberg, John Cruck. Woo, woo. Gary Sheffield. Ooh. Will the Thrill. David Bird License, get him slabbed. I would try that, guys, but I need somebody like so we can do a big thing. I've never done it. David Conine, I don't even really know how to do it. Larry Walker. Greg Maddox. Andy Van. We got Dennis Martinez and Darren Dalton known as the Joker. And then the cards. 
I got stacks of cards everywhere. Slab them and then try to shuffle them. Ah! Play solitaire. So those are pretty cool. Thank you. Uh, that's cool. That's cool, Vogs. Oh, that's super cool, Vogs. That's really cool. I forgot to chat or charge my tablet, so I'm having to read over Wicked's shoulder. So if I'm missing anybody in the chat, I apologize. All right, good. Is anybody interested in a wazzle for a box of opening day? A wazzle for a box of opening day. $4 a shot. $4 a shot for a box of opening day wazzle. Anybody interested in that tonight? Anybody see any cards they like? You want us to do another pack of them? Cleveland wants one spot. All right, Cleveland. Thank you. Do not pay yet until we fill, please. A mess of things wants three. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. I should have brought these cards and we could have uh, taken, we could have opened the packs on our dinosaur. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I'll bring, hey, Card Dreamer, are you still here? Look, I got some dinosaur packs. I could bring them when we go on the ride next week. Car Dreamer's doing football pack wars on Tuesday. Bradley Moore, nice video today, sir. Nice video. $4 a spot for a box of opening day. Crosby with one, all right. Yeah, no problem, dude. No problem. We enjoyed that. Oh, Shane, that sounds amazing. I love cilantro. One spot for DFD. Yeah, your video was really good, Bradley. I enjoyed watching your collection. DFD with one spot. Eight spots left, guys, for a box of opening day. Four dollars. Four dollars. We'll give it away tonight. Give it away. Give it away. Give it away now. You like those red hot chili peppers? Mm-hmm. 42, 45. And they're not even country. Miss Wicked is putting a, a set of dinosaurs <laughs> together. Yeah, we might have to open another pack, guys, because uh, I need some more. I got to fill my set, right? I like the gladiator cards. Those are pretty cool. The joust. That's all right. 48. Zapata. Oh, one too many giveaways. Hey, guys, the fact that he's singing a non-country song is impressive. I don't listen to that stuff. No, at all. He's a country fan. 52. Gemini. If it's not, um... Is that guy a wrestler? <laughs> he looks like he should be, man. Nine. If it, they canceled if... every concert I bought to hook it to. Oh, like, what kind of concerts? Three Rivers? Chili Peppers. Well... <clears throat> I remember when they made, uh, they had that cover on the Rolling Stone where it was just them and they were in the socks. <gasps> that was like so scandalous. I think I bought it and then I like had to hide it in my room because I didn't want my mom to find out that I had it. That stinks. I have the bags that <laughs> are, you sent. You two are weird enough. Oh, they'll be weird, man. They'll they'll be weird. What's crazy is that like we keep find like you guys keep finding like even weirder and weirder packs to send us. And I want to find the Nancy Kerrigan pack that Jeff Airtime sent us. But I don't know what. All right. Anybody else interested in a spot in opening day? RSR says two. All right. Um. Huh. This is the problem. Crosby says he bought the Janet Jackson Rolling Stones cover and hid it under his bed. Yeah. No problem, Bradley Moore. Uh, make a video, man, if you want to. Help us. Shout us out. Helps us grow. Guys, go sub to Bradley Moore. He Bradley Moore is cool. He made his first video today. Um, that's back when, like, I bought Ro Ro Rolling Stones because, like, the articles were Four dollars a spot for a spot, a chance in opening day. You had to read the reviews to figure out which CD you were going to buy. Because if you bought the CD, you had to, like, all 13 songs or however many were on there. 
And then based on the Rolling Stone review, I'd either buy it or I wouldn't. They wouldn't make or break it for me. I trusted them implicitly. Joe's are two. All right. Thank you, sir. Four spots left at two bucks, guys. Four spots left at two bucks. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> you kept those, huh? No. Four spots left at four dollars. Just my dad plays for the articles. Yeah. My dad had a huge box in the attic. I feel like my sister and I were like messing around one day and we found them. So I don't know if my mom ever knew that he had a Playboy subscription. I, <laughs> it's it's I, there are four dollars, Dave, and I said two by accident. Is that all right? It came out wrong. I have I have probably a hundred Playboys in the attic. What does sent you mean? He sent you money. You sent me five dollars. For what, Paul? A chance at opening day? What's going on? Oh, sweet, Troy. We love seeing videos. All right, Paul bought one spot. All right, guys, one spot left. Four dollars. One spot left at four dollars. The tree looking for weird and found something in the ring for a bit. <laughs> One spot left, guys. Yeah, we like our weird Wednesdays. Uh, so far, I haven't really seen anybody. Oh, thanks, Paul. Thanks, Paul. <laughs> well, I haven't seen anybody open any packs like this. So, it's kind of cool. All right, Joe's are the last spot. Right? Oh, I got to fill my wheel in. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. What does that smell? What? I don't smell anything. Oh, it smells like a gas or something. Maybe we're going to blow up. <laughs> I don't know. All right, anybody interested in the Stephen Hunter autograph? One dollar. One dollar chance. Where's my tablet? Maybe I can look in the No, it doesn't show up on it. What are you looking for, babe? Um, I just wanted to see the comments. Well, turn them out. Here's my phone. Stephen Hunter, he's from The Hobbit. It's, it's for Weird Wednesday. It's for Weird Wednesday. I picked up some weird stuff to try to... How about the channel? Paul. Paul, thank you very much. I got Paul's payment. Look, I got smart after last night. I got the PayPal app on my phone. <laughs> Did you guys have fun with Pack Wars last night? Should we do that again? Yes, no. Yeah, that's what we're trying to figure out for Saturday, guys. And we should do Pat. I opened those Power Rangers bricks you sent me, and those were so fun. Three of Rivers wants a spot. The boxes are filled right now. Three Rivers wants one. All right. Thank you, Three Rivers. Yeah, if you guys ever see packs that you um like that we open on Wicked Weird Wednesday, and you don't mind us holding it till we mail other stuff out for you, let us know. Like we'll throw those cards in. As long as you guys purchase something, we'll send cards for you for free. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we just um. We gotta mail them out with something else. But if you see something you like, let us know. You, you bought one of these on eBay too? That's cool. Uh, yeah. Don't pay yet, Three Rivers. Don't pay yet until we see if we can fill it. I'm not sure anybody, enough people are interested. I just wanted to give it a try. Um. Yeah, so like I said, if you guys ever are like, wow, those cards are cool. Unless I say that I'm putting them in a binder and then I'm keeping them. All right, so Saturday night, either we're going to do Pack Wars again. No, the opening day break. Oh, thank you, Three Rivers. How many spots for the Stephen Hobbit? Sea Advocate. Uh, we have 14 spots at a dollar. Thank you, Sea Advocate. The box is full right now, but we can probably do another one. Another. So Saturday night. Either. Yes, I gave you a spot. I got three rivers with a spot and advocate with two spots. You guys still have Ninja Turtle packs? Yes, we do. We do. Me neither. I never watched the movie either, but I thought it was cool to have an actor autograph. I just picked, like I said, I picked some stuff up for Weird Wednesday because we, you know, that's how we do our channel to help pay for things as we do these these little crazy things. We like our wazzles. So, so Saturday night we're trying to do, 
We're trying to do a break, but if it doesn't fail, we'll do uh, Pack Wars with Don Ross again. Uh, we're doing three boxes of Don Ross in one opening day. $24 ship, 30 spots. If we don't fill it, we'll try to do Pack Wars instead Saturday night. 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time will be on Saturday night. So, I have to get a minimum of 10 people for the Hobbit autograph to do that, though. I <laughs> dated what seemed like a Hobbit for now. All right, guys, the will is full for the opening day. Did everybody send payment? Here's our Star Wars cards. These are the Wonder Bread ones we were talking about. Oh, look at him, Han Solo. He was pretty much my first movie crush. I love Harrison Ford. Rafts wants a spot. You know the PayPal Rafts? I know you didn't, Crosby. Usually wait until the end and we get a running total. Did somebody say they like this real card? RSR sending pay. You're sending payment now, all right. Pepino cried when Solo died. Oh, when he came back in the um, car, or, oh, what's it so called? It was amazing. Did somebody Carbonate. say they like these? I think DFD asked about them. Oh. Yeah, you can wait until we're done, RSR. We don't have that much left, but we, yeah. DFD, did you like these? Raph, did you get the PayPal information? It depends what happens, man. It depends what happens. We could do a four box break. Yeah, no, it was totally April. Yeah, April. That was her name. April O'Neil. Ooh, baby. I got my Reese's Cup card. It's going to PSA. Yeah. Okay, yeah. sweet. I'm going to put them aside for you, DFC. Like I said, if you guys see stuff that you like and we're shipping you, like, let us know. We'll just forward it. Oh, here it is. DFC. Because uh, the last thing we need are, we just have fun opening them. All right, guys, we're going to give away the opening day right now. But look, I'm almost like halfway there to my full set of dinosaur attacks. I'm super stoked about those. One box of opening day coming right up. They're going in a binder. Oh, Blossom, yeah. Oh, mine is the Alec and six. Miss uh, Joseph says ship. Derek to him. Ship Derek to him. There are some days, buddy, where I would let you have him. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wicked put me down for down for rafts from me. Wicked put two spots down for rafts. All right. Ready? This is for the opening day. Here we go, guys. Good luck. RSR. RSR for a box opening day. RSR. Now the question is, RSR, do you want me to open it or do you want to open it? Here we go. Oh, you already had one. Sorry. RSR, do you want to open it or do you want me to? Hey guys, so you know how we talk about stuff we find in our attic? We have an entire box of these beauties. All right, Dreamer wants two spots for rafts, all right? All right. RSR says rip it. Okay. All right, Master Things, good luck in that break, man. How many spots? We have nine spots left for the Stephen Stephen Hunter autograph. Oh, Rafts with three spots then. All right, thank you, Rafts. Because Dreamer bought you two. <laughs> Pepino Man says the donkey started barking because he heard the dogs. <laughs> Baseball Betty opened the pack of cards today. I found it laying in the backyard. Yeah, guys. 
All At right. some point last night, she got into some baseball cards. Miss Wicked is going to watch the chat for the Stephen Howling, and I will start ripping the opening day for RSR. This is the first I've seen it, guys. Woo, come on, Mascot Relic. Come on, Mascot Relic. All right. What is it? Sorry. Give me three more for Sea Advocate, all right? Two, three. Thanks, all. Uh, us, too. I'm so glad you let me rip it. Pepino wants the rest of the spots. Okay. For the overgrown on it, auto. Five spots, Pepino. Five spots. Baseball Betty wants to eat opening day. No, Pepino just took them. Hey, Pepino, did you figure out what went on with that today? Pepino, please send to this. Not to my phone number. <laughs> please send to this, not to my phone number. Opening day, we already filled one. I'm opening it right now. And we could do another opening day if you guys want to. Thank you. Yeah, we don't even know what she uh, ripped, guys. It was 20... 28, it was Aaron Judge rookie year. RSR, you, you spelling spots for opening day. <laughs> he won the box of opening day. We did a, ra uh, a wazzle for it. We did a wazzle for it. <laughs> oh, there you go, Mike. <laughs> All right, so this is RSR's opening day box. Uh, I'm sure I did, Dreamer. Yeah, I got lots of payments. Miss Wicked can check, I guess. Hi guys, what are you doing? Max and Betty are chilling. They want to see what opening day Four. is all about. Oh, here, do you want to read the sign? It says, Peace, Love, and Pooches, Max. I don't know how to use it. Good luck, RSR! I don't know how to use the app, guys. Hey, even... Danny Boy, sorry we missed you going live tonight. Yes, I am going to set up the wheel for the Hobbit right We're now. We're just making sure that all payments are in. Yeah, can you all read right. it, babe? If I have questions, I'll ask. Hi, Buffers. All right, you're good. All right, so if anybody else wants to get in, we could do another opening day one. 14 spots at $4. But I'm going to open RSR's box right now. Let's see what we got in there, guys. I'm curious. And we have not seen any of this yet. Betty, Stop. Betty's trying to eat autographs now. I know you're hungry. And you're hungry. All right, so you get seven. Oh, you get thirty-six packs, seven packs, seven cards per pack. We're gonna have a lot of sorting. Oh, we better bring up a big trash can for <laughs> Sunday. We're gonna have a lot of sorting. Thank you, Papino man. Send prayers to the Colorado State Troopers. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank what you, part three. Of Colorado? What part of Colorado? Hey, uh, Three Rivers, thanks for the tip, man. Thank you for giving, sending a tip. Hey, guys, Three Rivers is having an auction tomorrow night. I think it's probably going to be after we go live or during where we go live. But you guys don't have to be here to see me. I'm here all the time. Go see Three Rivers auctions tomorrow. 252 cards in a box. Yeah. Let's get a mascot relic here, guys. Yeah, come on, come on. Eastern Colorado. All right, we got Tommy Pham. So these look exactly like Tops, Top Series 1. There is some variation cards, I think, too, right? Daniel Polk. All right, we got a Reggie Jackson. 100, 150 years of fun, Reggie Jackson. These are cool. Zach Greinke. I like Blossoms Dancing. Me, too. <laughs> I like your hat. Ryan Merlore. Yeah, Blossom had cool hats. Oh, yeah. For the price, guys, these are cool. For the price, these are cool. Marte Parte. Yeah. <laughs> Cedric Mullins. Oh, we got a mascot. Swinging oh. Friar. Swinging Friar mascot for the Padres. Oh, look at him. I was all excited. I thought it was a relic. Garrett Cole. Does, this, does the box say any autos or relics? There's, there is, but they're hard. They're hard to get. There's no guarantees. There's no guarantees on it. They're not like that Don Russ fire. They're, that's why they're a cheaper item. Raph, she's getting the wheel ready. 
She's getting the wheel ready, buddy. I'm working on it. Blake Snail. JD Martinez. I got a mascot autograph from my uh from my uh dogs for my birthday. I was so pumped up for that. Go back and check that birthday video out. It was so awesome. It was snuck into my fan mail packages it said in there. I still got the envelope. Still got the envelope from it. JD Martinez. Mariner Moose mascot. Felipe Vasquez. Tuki Toussaint rookie. Jose Altuve. Luis Urias. Joster says he saw the video five times and has loved it. Which one? When I pulled the pirate pair for my birthday. Uh, that was, I showed everybody at work that. I was like, look at this birthday win, guys. I said, you got to be kidding me right now. So these are opening day. Oh, oh, Felipe, Felipe Vasquez. Non-numbered, but it's. That's it's nice. Opening day photo. Oh, yeah. Hey, uh, RSR, I'll make a deal for that one. I'll do something for that one, man, for sure. It's mine. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ishiro. Yeah. That one's Corey good. Seager. Jeff McNeil. You gotta do Corey Seager. Corey Seager. Oh. <laughs> Pepino, should I do it? It's up to you. It's up to you, Pepino. You just, like, glaze by that one. No, because I don't know if I'm lying. I know. <laughs> it's not my thing. Corey Seager, Corey Seager, Corey Seager, Corey Seager, Corey Seager! Corey Seager! <laughs> I love it when you do that. <laughs> Max came running. Brandon Belt. RSR, I'd make a deal for all the Pirates base in here, too, if you want, like, $5 credit or something. If you or want. Whatever you think is fair. Whatever you think is fair. Francisco Lindor. I'm going to put this in my... Mike Clevenger. Yeah. Mike Maul, Ryan O'Hearn, Shoei Otani, cup card. All right, I'll do that. I'll give you $5 credit at Wicked Discounts for the Pirates. All right, guys, let's spin the wheel as soon as Miss Wicked gets back for the, for what are we giving them? The Stephen yeah. Howling, Stephen Hunter. The Hobbit. Card. The Hobbit, guys. The Hobbit. Good luck. Everybody's name is on the wheel. Good luck, Raps and Graps. Okay, ready? See you, Danny boy. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Big bucks, big bucks, big bucks, big bucks. Stop! See advocate. See advocate with the win. Woo, woo. You'll notice that there's two names on there. I didn't want uh, anybody to get mad that I was putting names too close. <laughs> That's LSP and Puppy Chow. All right, sorry. You want to throw in your mascot doubles too in our deal? Congrats, C Advocate! First will win for C Advocate. We turned Winter Wednesday into a cards baseball yeah, cards. I know. Matt Carpenter. How did that happen, guys? Oh, look at that one! Team tradition celebrating in the outfield pool. What are you eating? Really? He just. What are you eating? Ah. James Paxton. LSP and Puppy Chow is on the board. Yeah, yeah. Justin Smoke. I didn't space those out right, Pepina, but I didn't want to double up your name. Mm -hmm. Why do you say at least this? See, Advocate, congratulations for your first win on the wheel. We, um. Carlos Santana. Yeah, opening day, that's cool. Arizona Diamondbacks. Yeah, guys, sorry we threw baseball cards in the weird Wednesday. Justice Sheffield in the Mariners jersey, guys, that's cool. But we had to, we were excited to see them. I wanted to see these opening days. They came out today. And we, we were hoping for some mascots. Not gonna lie. Trevor Bauer. Oh, that's cool. Justice Sheffield is pretty cool. Oh, this one's thicker. Joey Gallo. Oh, uh, Cal. That's cool. That's a cool Cal Ripken card. Oh, that is cool. Jamison Talion. Oh. 
Derek Dietrich, Cassie Alanos, and David Price. Use these ones, babe. The ones we have a lot to get rid of. Hey, guys, so Saturday night, would you guys rather do Pack Wars? Would that be better? It's up to you guys. You let me know what I should prepare for for Saturday night. Do I like basketball mascots? I don't... Yeah, I like all mascots. Jack Flaherty. Justin Turner, Justin Turner, Justin Turner. Pirate Perry! Woo! That is a major hit, guys. And Scherzer, black uniform Judge. Too. Yeah, that's a rare one. I gotta touch it. Trevor Story, Alex Gordon. We're allowed to have the doubles, babe. All right. Well, I'm just looking. On our $5 credit deal. We can't do Pack Wars with opening day. And also, guys, how much did you guys enjoy Don Ross? Because I, I, if I have to, I need, I want to order another case before we get to it. Hey, RSR, I'm just saying I got a bunch of really weird cards if you're interested in some. That was for the signed card. We already did the baseball cards. RSR1. I'm opening them right now. Paul. Paul. Yeah, we got that. RSR1 opening, opening day, and I'm opening his pack right now. He's letting us. Uh, he wanted to know what you said. Oh, I was just teasing about the pirate parrot. I said I would trade you for some weird cards. Miss Wicked said she would trade you for some <laughs> weird cards if you wanted to trade her that pirate one if we don't get a double. But we'll probably come across some. Hmm? I can give you some hobby, man, Pepino. If you want a box. I only got six left. Aw, thank you, RSR. Um, oh, Chinese food sounds good. I gotta get Wicked to log onto the computer for me, guys. I don't know what it's... secret password. Yeah. I didn't... That pack's open. I didn't show it. Yet. Okay, I'll show you the pack. <gasps> Let's see. RSR, what's the weirdest stuff that you like that we opened? Anthony Rizzo. She's getting ready for uh, her... Uh... Mitch Hanniger. Oh, look at that feel. Texas Rangers. Doesn't be <gasps> cool the players sign them. Hey, Pepino, oh, man, look at that with the Texas flag in the back and the American oh, flag. I know what I'm doing. Huh? If I get a Dodger one, I know what I'm doing. Oh, that is Miguel Duhar. This is a preview of Sunday Joey night. Joey Ruchessi. RSR is awesome, guys. If you're not sub to him, he puts out awesome videos, and he is also one of the kindest, most generous people in the community. And that's a like a strong statement to make because this card community is made up of some really amazing, generous people. I still am floored with the stuff that he um, sent us. Our very first package from him. I mean, it was just like, wow. He is a very, very generous person. So if you're not sub to him, like you absolutely should, because, and he's doing it with his sons too. So it's he's a good guy to sub to. He's like I said, I always enjoy watching his videos. He's got a nice setup. The one he did where he opened our mail it was really cool because he put uh, Power Rangers cards in the background. I I thought that was neat. So make sure that you guys are sub to him and watch his videos because, like I said, they're really good. Um, fan mail we normally do on Saturday night because we have all of our central appeal box, but they, um, close early, so we can't get to them. Thanks, Bobby. We had fun with the Don Ross. Raphael Devers. <laughs> Using people coal. Hey, that's, that's cool. Brandon Crawford. Oh, look at that. 150 years of fun. Sandy Koufax. That's cool. That's a really sweet card. Evan Longoria, Aldemus Diaz, Billy Hamilton. <laughs> How to take Bryce Harbor today and gladly pay you tomorrow. Jose Abrua. How do I say it? Abreu. I'll get these guys' names eventually. Said, ah, just try, right, try. When I'm at work, that's when I get in a lot of the video watching, and then I go back later and uh, comment, so. Wicked's always like, what are you doing? Whose video are you watching? Ooh, Robert, that sounds good. Let's see, we had Tanaka Masahiro. These are really pretty cards. Kyle Schwarber, the colors are nice on them. <gasps> Baltimore Oriole. 
We have our picture with this guy. Uh, Brandon Nemo. Michael Kopak. He's got like a baby face. He looks really young. Here we have the Juan Soto. And then, ooh, Chris Archer. Oh, thank you, RSR. We're like huge mascot dorks. I don't know what our problem is. Like I said, maybe it's a Disney thing too. We went last year for Mother's Day. And it was so cute because the pirate parrot had his mom there. And she was all dressed up. And they were having a blast on the field. And there we go. Trey Mancini. I actually got into baseball. I don't know if anybody cares. But um, for quite a while... I was a single mom. I have a daughter. Her name is Colby. She's 15 now. And um, going to pirate games was a really inexpensive way for us to like just go somewhere for the day and do something uh, really cheap. The pirates make kids tickets like super, super cheap. And baseball was a sport that I vaguely understood enough that I could explain it to her. And um, so that's uh, how I fell in love with the pirates was going down there and, you know, watching their games with her and spending a lot of time. And oddly enough, ooh, Toronto Blue Jay. Uh, how Wicked and I got together, we worked together, and um, I used to talk to one of his really good friends about the Pirates. Like, we'd talk about how the Pirates are playing, and, you know, yada, 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 and he'd always kind of come over and, like, break up our conversations. Now, keep in mind, his friend is held, Jimmy? Mm. Maybe, I don't know, 60s. Maybe, like, in his mid-60s. <laughs> yeah. And he'd always come and, like, crash our conversations. And uh, so I'd always be like, okay, really, guy? Like, we're talking about pirates here. And eventually it just kind of evolved to, uh, you know, relationship. Him and I got to know each other better. So I like the pirates for a lot of personal reasons. And even though they're terrible and lose consistently, I will always root for them. That's a sweet picture. Andrew Benatendi. Alex Bregman. And Kyle Freeland. I like the Rockies because they are the easiest to tell apart in the card breaks. All right. All right. I'm out of here, guys. I'm going over to the computer to sort my uh, Disney cards. All right, guys. We got another Wazzle. Another Wazzle for a Star Wars. Tim Rose, Admiral Akbar. 14 spots at $3. Tim Rose as Admiral Akbar. 14 spots at $3, guys, if anybody's interested in that. Did you mark down who won this? Yes, he advocated. I should have. I should have. That would have been fun. I should have. I should have. That would have been fun. Huh. In stereo. Did he sell you a spot for the Razzle on the first day? No. He probably didn't think of it or else he would have. Miss Wicked put a pirate card in the wrong pile. I think it was Chris Archer. I put him back. She pulled it back out. <laughs> it's just for the doubles, right? Or is it for whatever pirate card? I don't remember. We'll figure it out. Um, Guys, Danny Boy is trying to get to 200 subs. Head on over there and help him out. Carlos Martinez, Corey Kluber, the Babe Ruth, Posey, so Max Muncy, Piscotti, Famel Reyes. Cornette will take two spots. Thank you. Thank you, RSR. All right, Cornette with two spots on the Tim Rose Admiral Akbar autograph. 14 spots, $3 each. Sinshu Chu, Mike Trout, Matt Trout, Matt Trout, Matt Trout. Ah, Mike Trout. <laughs> <laughs> Verlander, Abdubal Herrera, Scooter Gannett, Jeanette. It's Wazzle, W, Wazzle, Wazzle, Wazzle. It's a trap, guys. It's a trap. Thank you so much, Wicked Power Couple. Thanks, Three Rivers. Thank you. You spell Razzle so much. <laughs> Did you start these for me? I don't know. Thirteen, three bucks, guys. Three bucks. Three Rivers, thanks for joining us and being here, man. I appreciate you. 
And we do your motto too, man. We try to do something nice every day for somebody. Kindness is free. Sprinkle that stuff everywhere. Yep, kindness is free. Eddie oh, Rosario, no. John Lester, Kevin Pillar. I thought that was pretty cool. Elderton Simmons, Matt Olson. Oh, that's a cool Ronald Acuna Jr. That's a cool card. Ooh, Bryce Harper. Cool. Oh, Ki Kiki Chu, Kiki Chu, rookie, rookie. That's his first tops card, guys. First tops card. Ooh, good pull, RSR. I'm gonna sleeve that one. Thanks, Ashley. Nice. Charlie. David Dahl. Anybody interested? It's a trap. Akbar. Three bucks. Tim Rose. Autograph. Star Wars. Pretty cool. We do weird. Ronald Acuna Jr. Cup card. Glaber Torres Cup card. Opening day in Seattle. That's cool. Matt Chapman. Conforto, Frazier, Villar. The colors pop really nice on these cards. Yeah, these cards are nice. I yeah, like them. They do a good job. Makata, like the of Joey Wendell, Which I guess that's Arnie Banks. All right, pretty cool. Ashley's uploading the video in two days for his uh, giveaway. Sweet, guys. Go check him out if you're not already. Lots of cool football content. I think that was your first fan video you ever... Like, yeah, that's the that. only one I've done. Yeah, it was Ashy. Ashy is the only one that I've done a video for. Like... Oh, the Bobblehead Museum. Although we would have done one for Pepino, man. We would have known about yeah. the name slaughter. Part. I would have done Pepino's name slaughter one for sure. We would have just played back any one of our live streams. Oh, thanks. Yeah, basically. Yeah, that's basically what they are. Nathan and then... is an amazing person, Grocer. You are absolutely... And then they throw in some short prints and some other stuff. This card community, though, I cannot say it enough. It is filled with so many good people. I mean, you hear about, like, people have horrible experiences on the Internet with, like, trolls and stuff. And, like, everybody here is so cool. I have a hundred. I have over a hundred pirate bobbleheads in the attic. Over a hundred pirate bobbleheads in the attic, guys. I'm actually selling them. Uh, Phil Bork and my Mickey Mouse cards. Right. Oh, you're entering our giveaway! Yay! Oh, thank you, Miguel Cabrera. Oh, yeah! Tukey Toussaint Blue! Guys, I'm going to give a prize away for whoever gets uh, Wicked to Cry. Ha! <laughs> <Huh. laughs> when watching your videos. It's come pretty close so far. <laughs> Tukey Toussaint. It means a lot to him that you guys are taking time and doing that. I cannot tell you enough. It means the world to him. It's Jake Arietta, Mike Folowitz, David Ortiz, Bregman, Kyle Freeland, Bryce Harper. Another one. Another one. Kikichu. Kikichu. experience i guess in the youtube community but like you always hear stuff and i follow a lot of like disney stuff and like some of those people are just mean to each other like <laughs> it's supposed to be the happiest place on earth and those people will stab you so um it's it's amazing i mean you guys are so awesome it could probably be that there's not that many women in here and maybe that's what keeps it positive but um it's just an amazing thing to be a part of and we thank you guys so much for Spending time with us and, you know, making us a part of your life. Because when you guys are like our new best friends, we now have, you know, 500. <laughs> I, said, I said I said work every day and I'm like, I got to get home and get on the internet, man. Yeah. And you guys make all the difference in our day, too. Like, when we're at work, we're like, blah. Kiki, do you home. love me? Kiki. And we're like, yeah, let's do this. Hee hee. So. Ozzy. Thank you guys enough for what you've done for us. It's amazing. 
I didn't want to interrupt her talking, guys. That's why I was giving a thumbs up to you guys. I run my mouth a lot. It's okay. He loves looking thumbs up. Jester, I'm starting to get a worry. Does your wife know about me? <laughs> you wanted Miss Wicked to mail me. Now you love my thumbs. I'm a little concerned. Mitch Garver. I'm so glad you found Joester. I'm so glad I found Joester and Shane, too. Yeah. All right, Ars. All right, I'll text you, man. You guys have uh, really brought him out of his cell. I text. There's probably... I've not ever talked to anybody on my phone except for Miss Wicked. And I probably text about 10, 10 of you guys a day. He shows up in my cube, and I'm like, oh, I see your uh, side chicks are up now. You don't want to talk to me? Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Yeah, she's like, aren't you talking to me today? Are all your boyfriends up, your side <laughs> chicks? I can't help it. I don't know. It just makes me happy. Awesome. We have the same things in mind. And like I said, when I talk to a lot of pe you guys, we don't even... We talk about cards. We talk about family life, things like that. I let you know what I'm doing tonight, but we don't really talk about like YouTube stuff and stuff. We actually talk like friends. Michael Lorenzo, Matt Trout, Matt Trout, Matt Trout, Matt Trout. See, Advocate does have great videos, Ashy. Ah, uh, thanks for listening and watch all your work. His little boys are so cute, and they do a great job on their videos. Coda cracks me up. They're both adorable, but Coda's funny. That Juju card you pulled the other night was sweet, too. Look him up. He's an awesome player. He's what uh, sports people should be. He's a role model. Or he acts like it. Well, he Or he acts like it. But if he's acting, man, he's putting on a pretty good act. We hung out one night after a Steeler game. And, um... Aw, that's so sweet, Joseph. And he, um... Was oh, what do we got here? Congratulations on the back. <gasps> so in a pack, you... Oh, dirt! Show me oh. Otani Stadium dirt. Look at that, RSR. You only get two cards in the hit pack, though. Show me Otani Stadium dirt. I uh, see Advocate's little boy pulled a Juju card, uh, Evgeny. Stadium dirt. Those. How rare are those, guys? Oh, that is sweet. Stadium dirt. I saw that they were doing that. Let's see how rare those are real quick. It is a hit. See, guys, that's why you buy into the wazzles. <laughs> dirt is legit. That's crazy. I saw that they were doing them. Yeah. <laughs> You have to taste it, right, to make sure it's legit dirt. That's cool as crap, guys. I'm what looking. What did the pack feel like? Was it, did it have like a bumper card or anything? No, it's just the. It felt like a full pack, but they only had one card in there. How thick is it? Oh, that's a pretty good size. Pittsburgh Heat. Thanks, Ashley. I'm trying to find the odds, guys. Anybody? Somebody, see if they can find the odds on that. And Ashley, the fact that you hang out with us and you're not even really a baseball fan. Because we know that you like the football and, you know, that's your sport. So the fact that you spend this much time with us is just awesome. I mean, this is just really the best community of people. Oh, are you kidding me, Pepino Man? That would be awesome. I was, didn't you make a thing about that? Uh, a shadow box? I was trying to tell Miss Wicked about that the other night. That would be awesome. Slugger. Lorenzo King. Oh, Cleveland. Look what we just opened with that Pittsburgh Heat. Cleveland. Pittsburgh Heat right there in his box. Aw, thanks, Ashy. Thanks, Ashy. Pittsburgh Heat right there. I can't name more than 10 baseball players either. Don't feel bad. Not a bad box, RSR. And you got another blue. Hater. Josh Hater Blue. Clemente. I know that's the worst part about the wheel and stuff, Joster, 
is I want everybody to wheel or to win, and it's always like, oh, I mean, I'm excited no matter who it is, but I, I literally want everybody to win everything all the time. It's hard to can't pick. Gene Segura, good job. Kepler, one pack left, guys. Not, not bad. We got a relic though. Well, diamond dirt. That's pretty cool though. Yeah, I like that diamond dirt. Diamond dirt, cool. not bad. Kristen Yelich. You would pull something. Rhea Iglesias. Team yeah. traditions. Ashley, we're looking into that just for you, buddy. Yeah, we are getting some football, man. We are getting some football. You said Stuff, I hope so. so. I hope you guys. Will, we're gonna try to do, start doing some football on this channel. I hope you guys are interested in that too. I know Crosby is. I'm not sure who else might be, but we're gonna try to throw some football in and some stuff like that. I uh, try to switch it up a little bit. Keep, uh, it fresh. keep it different. Try to keep doing things. Uh, next Tuesday night. Next Tuesday night, I am gonna do an attic call video again. I'm gonna go back to them next Tuesday night. Um, but. But that'll be our last video for the weekend. Well, I'm saying I'm doing a football video. I'm saying I'm doing it, but I'm not sure if I am. I'm saying I am, but I'm not sure. We might do something else. I I take some lawn bowling cards. All right, you guys are down with the football. All right, cool. Oh, cool. Cool. We're down with the football. All right, guys. So real quick, I want to talk about. Um, so Saturday night, I guess we're gonna try to do Pack Wars Dawn Ross again. It's two two packs for fifteen bucks. We have six boxes left at Dawn Ross. I just want to know, I have to get an order in if you guys, after these six boxes are gone, want to keep doing Don Ross or we should just call it. Why not? The only reason I ask is for Pack Wars. There's not anything else that gives the numbered cards like that. We do all random teams, Ashley, so I don't know if you'll get the Giants. Well, we'll play by ear, too. But we'll work it out. We'll work it out yeah. somehow. Um, so, I just, I'm just trying to get a feel for what you guys think. I have next week. I won't be here. We're gonna do some videos from Dawn, uh, from Disney. Uh, we have Inception coming out next week. It's seven. You only get seven cards, and it's like sixty set, sixty five, seventy dollars a pack. Football does, so you can do pack wars on that. All right. Football gives more numbered cards. All right. Uh, that's I'm just throwing that out there. We could do something with that, but it would probably be like ten dollars a card. And we'd have the ran like you buy a card, you buy a random spot. We just random them. I open the pack and whatever. So if you get spot one, you get card one. You get spot two. Uh, with uh, Inception, you're getting uh, two numbered cards, one autograph, and three base cards. But the three base cards sell for about ten dollars a piece usually when it first comes out. So it's kind of cool deal. But we won't be doing that. I'm gonna try to throw something up for next Sunday when we get home. We get home on Saturday. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we're going to do with that. Oh, professional ping pong. I would be down. Maybe we'll uh, just do pack wars on Sunday. Because I I appreciate each and every one of you. But I got to get on here and hustle these breaks to get them filled. So that's why I, don't, I won't be able to do video time and stuff next week. So Saturday. Look at this right now so far. Hey, Monday night, Mikey. I'm good, baseball collector. Right now I have that power mail. And I didn't even go to my post office box yet. A lot of those cards are for um, razzes and stuff, but that's a lot of razzes and stuff down there that we're going to be doing. Did the break sell out? Which break, Crosby? The Topps opening day break did sell out, but I got you a spot from Shane. Saturday, our break is not even close to sold out, so I think we're going to do... Uh... <laughs> Shane. <laughs> <laughs> That's eBay purchases, though, Pepino. That's eBay purchases. Cow Farmer logo patch. Going to be on the Raz wheel. Um, yeah, eBay is our biggest... Uh, Brian Anderson. Correspondence. Yeah, eBay sends us. If you guys ever want to send us anything, man, uh, with that, for to help the channel out that we can Raz off or for our collection or weird, weird packs you want us to open up, feel free to, man. Feel free to. We love mail. Uh, so we sold two spots on this at $3. Anybody else interested in uh, Tim Rose autograph? Admiral Akabar before we get out of here. Bradley Moore has a Wicked shout-out video coming. Sweet, sweet, sweet. We love to see those guys. We love to see those shout-out videos. They definitely help our channels. And I, every... They make, they just make us feel good. They're awesome. Pino never bought anything online. I don't know. Uh, you just buy cards off from me online. 
We didn't go to the store, Pepino. We buy everything online. I buy everything <laughs> online. There's an antiquarian course. Dude, I forgot about your other wheel ones. Yeah, you did get that epic Indian uh, triple. We were even calling that the CCC car, er, card. Your plate still never came, Ashy. Yeah, I don't know about that, dude. I, I'm missing cards from him. Crosby's missing cards from him. Not to be rude, I don't know about that guy. It's one thing if we tell you guys we're going to hold your cards, but if you need them, like, we'll absolutely send them out. We just try and save on shipping here. Yeah, we just try to bundle your cards for a week. We don't, we're not here to rip anybody off. I don't know if that's what's going on with that guy or he has problems. But a lot of us are missing cards from his auctions. That's why we have those fancy cards. I don't auctions. know. I don't know if he is. We're hoping maybe you're just going through a rough patch. I hope it's just office. something's going on with right now. So, yeah, guys, you guys want to send us anything? But we're going to make it right with you, Ashley. I might. I think there might be a Giants card in one of those packages that I got for you. Who is this? I don't want to say anybody's name until we know for sure. Oh, you know what? I didn't order from uh, that COMC. I ordered that the dogs, actually. Max and Betty got that pirate parrot. And they shipped really fast. I was impressed. He's... I never shopped on eBay because he owns He's making a joke. Oh. <laughs> he's making a joke, baby. And look, I got this Because he said he never buys too. anything online. I actually, the only one I've never used is Four Sharp Corners. I've never heard of that Ooh, one. Ooh, look at that guy. All right, guys. Cornette, Cornette, do not pay because we did not fill this, so do not pay. Please. Bar darts. You know what I would like to see? I would like to see cheerleading basketball cards. That'd be pretty sweet. Cheerleaders who moonlight as basketball players. <laughs> Thanks, Joster. <laughs> Thanks, Joster. Friday night, that's what I'm going to go watch. I'm going to go watch Colby play basketball. So that should be something similar. I don't know what's in this package. I'm just... Yes, Joster, that's the best advice you can I already get. showed that one earlier. These are going to be for Raz's, guys. I hope you're not wazzled out. I hope you continue to uh, get them. I'm just worried that we might over wazzle you guys. And what do you do? Just tell us to time out. Yeah, just say slow it down for a little bit or something. I just don't want you guys to be over. But we know some people like the wazzles. So and, we don't mean to be annoying. And also, I don't want some people to not buy wazzles because they get mad because other people. Oh, no, Ashley, we're going to. Don't worry, man. We're going to take care of it. Do you have a card Cleveland card collection? Huh. <laughs> For your dart league? We don't even have dart boards. Some of these packages I haven't even opened. I don't even know what's in them. <laughs> Some of these I don't even know what's in them. Myself. Look at this patch. Oh, that's sweet. That looks like a stripe off a sleeve. Nah, this is, we're going to get off here, Ashy, tonight. We're going to get off here tonight. This, out of 99. I could take that down. This is our short night on here, supposed to be. Supposed to be our short night on here, but I don't know. Professional. I love Connect Four. What's in this pack? Let's that check. game is the best. Let's check this pack out. We're going to stay for a couple more minutes, then we're going to get out of here, guys. Instagram is down. Instagram and Facebook were both hacked today. We got a Henry Owens. Yeah, a short night. Three hours I know. Later. Henry Owens. Jeff Bagpipes. Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. 7.30 tomorrow night. Uh, Chase the Jeter. We have one spot left for $25. Look at that Mitchell Boggs. All right, have a nice night, Monday night, Mike. Look at that Mitch Boggs card. Oh, wow. Look at that. X-Fractor. I don't know. I don't run Instagram. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I think it was Bobby today in his video he did. He got one that was so shiny, he couldn't even read the uh, number on it. It was a gorgeous card. I don't remember who it was. That's what the problem. Facebook, I was trying to send a picture on Facebook Messenger today, and it, was, it wouldn't send pictures. Facebook and Instagram got hacked somehow. Just Facebook Messenger, though. So shiny. I broke Instagram yesterday when I went back five years on Pepino Man's account. Fix that it, Wicked. Fix it. <laughs> oh, 
Look at that hockey one. How'd that get in here? Oh, weird. And it's a penguin. The moose. No, you cannot. What card was it, Miss Wicked? There's a Dodger fan, Drew, if he's still here. I don't know. Bobby posted, I think that was Bobby's video that I watched. It was a really pretty one. It was one of those refractor cards. And the way it was, it was just hard to read it. Wasn't it Bradley Moore? No, it was not Bradley Moore. It was our field day, I thought. I don't know. Oh, yeah, it was. Yeah, I thought it was Bobby who did it. Um, you guys want to do a wazzle for that headberg right now? I mean, Joseph's already thrown up two spots. I remember the movie. Yeah, me too. The first time I ever went to a Penguins game is back when they were so bad that tickets were like $4. Moose! In the early 2000s. And I just remember getting ice cream at the arena and walking around and hoping it didn't fall in on us. $3 a spot on the headberg. $3 a spot, guys. $3 a spot on the headberg. I'll throw it out there already. You guys are throwing up things. I guess we might have to get some more hockey, babe. All right. Hedberg, $3 a spot. Bert, you really want... Joster wants four. Okay, Joster got four. It's that thing where you shoot pucks down the ice. Hit them in the net. I guess it's a good thing we went through some mail, huh? Yeah. Crosby, did you watch the... Um Evgeny and Crosby uh, challenge today, the Key Bank. That was awesome, where they were like dude perfect, and they were trying to shoot pucks. $3 a spot, Bert. You really want two spots? I know you're just kidding, man. I know you're just kidding. <laughs> I'll take a minimum of 10 spots on this to get it. So we can give it away tonight. I want to ship some mail tonight, too. Oh, right. good night, Bye, RSR. I'm texting you right now. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, Crosby was so bad at it. Crosby was so bad at it, though. Yeah, Getty crushed it. Crosby was sucking. I oh, see so you didn't really want two spots. All right. Oh, you don't know anything about hockey. Yeah, they should do teeth. Bradley. Crosby, you want any spots? Bye, RSR. Oh, this is the... Today they shot it from up in the stands. They shot it up in the stands. They're Bobby's Lost Card Treasures, guys. Go subscribe to them. Game you squid. That would be good. I PC the Pirates in dollar bills. I PC the Pirates and Presidents and Mascots. <laughs> Alright, if nobody else wants a spot, Shane Duga is going to take the rest of the spots. Does anybody else want a spot? Shane Duga is going to take the rest. Oh, he was talking to... Duga! He, everything. he doesn't really PC anything. He just I uh, Team USA cards he really likes. Game lost teeth. Yeah, there'd be a lot of those. Those would be the common cards, Bradley Moore. Maybe the Zeke. RPA, yeah. <laughs> all right, guys. All right. He likes hockey and cowboys is what he PCs pretty much. All right. Last call and Duga's going to take all the spots left. Joster has four and Duga's going to take the last ten. Last call and then we're going to put it on the wheel. There's no uh, way. Crosby's saying no to a wazzle? I think Crosby's saying no to a hockey one too. Wow. Just making sure. Oh, he has one. He wants one? He says he has one. Oh, maybe he has, like, hard already. Oh, okay. Okay. I still didn't see that. All right. All right, am I doing the board? Yeah, four for Joseph, the rest for Duga. Duga! Duga! Okay, one, two, two. Oh, 
Crosby has one spot. Oh. He said it. I never seen it. Okay. One, two, four for Joster, one for Crosby. Four for Joster, one for Crosby, and the rest for Duga. I'm just doing single letters. All right. We're family here. All right. We should probably go see what Betty's doing. It sounds like she's... I can go. Okay. All right, guys. Betty? Where is she? Is she downstairs? Cosby said he's trying CCC's tactics to win one spot. All right, guys. I think I sound like she got her bark box off the table. That's what it sounded like. All right, guys. I got to spin it and hold the phone because we're going to eat the bad dog. Shane Duga. I can't believe Duga won. I cannot believe Shane Duga won. I cannot believe that. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, being with us tonight. No problem, Bradley. I'll do everything I can do, man. I can do anything I can do to help you guys out and give back to you guys and do whatever I can do. And we get so excited when you guys make your first videos, too. Yeah, like, they're so cool. So I'll tell you what we're going to do tonight. Right now... After this video uploads, I hope you guys all enter. We're going to do... What do we want to do? What do we want to do, Miss Wicked? I don't know. What are you thinking? Ooh. I'm thinking whoever tells me what they like... Well, we already did that one. Huh. Huh. Let's think about this. Bye, Joester. What's the one thing you wish they had made uh, trading cards of in the 90s? Yeah. Say, comment below. Comment below when this video uploads what's the one thing that you uh, thought they made trading that they that you were looking forward to making trading cards in the 90s. And we'll send you some weird, w wicked weird Wednesday cards. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Yeah, you want to just make something up then if you don't. He man anything you can think of. Yeah. Bobby's world, yeah. If you had a favorite show. Miss Airtime, are you I didn't know you guys were still here. How are you doing? Miss Airtime. I wish that the store Merry go round in the mall, they would have made trading cards because those would have been super sweet, because that's where all the cool kids shop. How are you making out, Miss Airtime? Oh, we definitely will. Miss Airtime, we are sending you all of our love and hopefully you feel better soon. Yeah. Oh, Chris Carter, see, that's a good one. Comment it below. <laughs> Don't go. Comment it below when the video uploads. And yeah. we're going we're to randomly pick somebody to win. And we'll send you guys some of our collection now that you know our uh, dirty little secret and how much cards we have in this room. Chris Carter, did you what? <laughs> Do it after the video uploads, guys, and we'll randomize the comments and pick a he winner. an Urkel card. Oh. Um, we will be boxing on Saturday, Shane says. I'll... Miss Wicked, Mr. Wicked, can you shout my eBay store out? That's competition. I can't do that. I'm sorry. But I'm sure they can read it in the comments. All right, guys. We have one spot left for Throwback Thursday, guys. 25 bucks, too. Did I do that? Huh. All right, guys. Peace, love, and pooches. Do something nice for somebody each and every day. You know how we go out on this channel. See you tomorrow night. With us. See you tomorrow night around 7.30 for 1993 Chasing the Jeter. Woo, 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 woo. Wait. That's where the Jeter is. Yeah, it might be 25 bucks. Give it a chance. Jeter.